task 4.8 stock slash service item maintenance to record our stock and service item maintenance into the AutoCount system first you have to click in at the stock and after that you have to choose stock item maintenance so to create a new stock what you need to do is to click on the line of create a new stock item and it will appear the new entry for you to key in the stock so let's key in the first stock that we have so the first stock that we have is the group is PHO so what you need to do you need to go to the group here and assign the PHO phone and the second step will be to assign the item type so you choose what is the item type so the item type is MTO that is the second step the third step is to key in the item code but for this item code you don't have to manually key in what you can do is just click at the small plus sign here to auto generate the item code so you will get PHL001 the next thing to do is to key in the description there which is mtorola 501 for the description and then after that you can see we untick the stock control because this is our stock the costing method is weighted average if let's say you have a different costing method you can actually change from here okay so the unit of measurement we already set as the default as you need so the next thing is to key in the standard selling price so you key in the standard selling price which is 900 okay after that we don't have any uh, details for the standard cost so we skip and we just move to the stock level so the stock level here you have to key in what is your minimum quantity for example we minimum quantity is 20 for this stock item and what is the reorder level 40 normal level 150 maximum quantity 160 and the last one reorder quantity is 100 so that is the only details that you have to key in so before you proceed with the second stock item that you have you can actually tick after save proceed with a new item then only you click ok to save and you may start to proceed with the second one until the repair and service
For the last one, repair and service. First, you have to assign the group of repair. Second, you have to clear up the item type. So, to clear everything here, you have to highlight. And then, in your keyboard, you have to uh, press Ctrl, Delete button. And after that, only you click on the plus sign to generate the item code. Then you can start to key in the description, repair and service. And then you key in the standard selling price 50. And after that, you have to untick the stock control button here because your repair and service is not part of the stock item. So we have to untick the stock control because we don't have any stock level to be key in so to save the last stock that we have we have to untick the after save because after this we have no more item to key in and after that we just click ok and in your stock item listing you can see you have 10 of your stock item that you have key in just now